Yo, yo, what is up everyone? We are playing Champion Delivery. I've been given a Thresh. To be honest, I kind of want to take Branching out here. I like Silver Spoon as well. Uh, I mean, honestly, it's probably Branching out. I feel like Branching out is so OP. Branching out with Silver Spoon. I do like Silver Spoon here too, because I have good Econ already. Let's go branching out. Good sack one as well. Don't feel too bad about it. Uh, let's buy the Zyra. Sell Kate. Nah, Lux. Interesting. As for me, I am not sure. I'm not sure what I'm playing. I mean, we probably just take this loss and hope we hit some two-star one costs, like Severe or something. And then see what spat we get and play around it. Um, I kind of want to hold this. Okay, give me something good. Boom. Sage. Is that not just getting reforged right now? Arcanist. I don't hate it. I'm sure we can find a, find a use for it. Uh, if I'm playing Arcanist, I'm probably not playing to the Storm Reaver board. Let's just play Warden here. Jack's pair is good. I don't want to sell the Thrash though. Oh, I actually should have played Jack's pair over, over this fella. What's our Ink Shadow? Fury. Arcanist Spat. I might have to play Lux, honestly. Oh, auto the Kazakhs. Nice. Good job. That's a good loss. Definitely not unhappy with the loss. One unit loss. Congrats on the win, bro. Both made 20. Nice. That's a great hit. I have this. 7, 8, 9, 10. I don't love it. Mainly because I can actually play Fortune if I hit it. Like, I can play Zoe or Trist off Carousel and play Fortune here. Fortune's not awful with Arcanists. The only thing is, with Arcanist Cat Spat, you kind of want to play um, Lux. I feel like not many other good arcs. Or Fated, I guess. Were there any unfor like forgeable spats? Not forgeable spats I would have liked. Like when I reroll the sage, I guess Reaper's pretty good. I think Shadow's decent. Everything else is like good, but like everything else that is good is kind of forgeable. I mean, I guess this is just 20 P AP to everyone if I just play one arc, so it's like not bad. Oh, interesting. Sniper's focus. We just play Aphelios. Do I hate it? I don't hate it. Is there a guy playing Aphelios that we, we've already played into? Okay, honestly, I'm kind of down to just play Aphelios here. Sniper's focus, Rage Blade, and a sword. It's definitely not bad. Definitely not bad. I mean, Soraka can even probably hold this stuff. I want to see everything. Um, I mean, I must be able to make a better board than this, right? One, two, not gonna spat. Three, self recon. Sniper's Focus, Rage Blade. Okay, let me just like lose streak until neutrals, I guess. And then build a Fated board. So that's one unit. Time to get one more. Get the Garen. Nice. Great, 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 great. 
three unit loss. Can't be super unhappy about that. I don't mind the lose streak here, mainly just because I'm rich. Like 40 gold is not bad. I get street gold value. Arcanist and Mumu doesn't sound bad. Yes, well, three level, no reason not to, right? Is AP scaling a Mumu any good? It's pretty good. They're all AP. I'm done. Who's the guy who's Lux? This guy. Oh, he has a Mumu too. Oh my god, that Mumu is actually terrifying. That, that Mumu is so scary. Oh, wait, I win one. Uh, was that part of the plan? Not particularly, but I don't really mind that. That was not part of the plan, I'll be honest. I was kind of meant to lose. Maybe I should have scouted. So he has to make 50. I don't hate it. I mean, I could just re-roll. If that wasn't another Mumu player, like I would literally just re-roll a Mumu Lux. I, I guess it is just Aphelios. I'm sure we can make it work with Arcanist Spat. It's probably not that bad. I mean, honestly, I probably just hold the Lux and play it next turn. That's my next unit. Control 1 for Cuteness Overload. <laughs> that is cute. MR, not bad. Decor Thrash is always really good. We're looking for IE for Aphelios, I guess. Adaptive Helm, not bad. That is the IE. Nice Thrash. I mean, I see you probably roll here. Try and build like a, a decently strong board. Nice. Uh, I would love to drop this, to be honest with you. But I, I still can't. Definitely still can't. Until like Aphelios too. It dug pretty deep. I did dig pretty deep here. Yo, Trist, what the heck? That's Sela Kindred. Yeah, it's fine. She's not my carry. 620 here. I feel like people are 630. This has 640. What the heck? I'm broke. I'm actually broke. It's fine, I rolled. I have two, three star front lines. It can't be that bad. Surely can't be that bad. I could drop Lux and Mumu and play five fated if I hit one more. Oh wait, that's actually sick. Nice. Nice. Um, let's play this then. Fated this. i.e. Sniper's Focus. And then we probably drop a Mumu. Okay, I kind of regret not selling, not keeping the Kindred, but it is what it is. Does anyone have backline damage? Like, yeah, actually. They do. Maybe I should take healing. It's probably attack speed. The healing's kind of nice, though. 3% HP. Be bad. Like I'm scared of backline damage because if my Aphelius dies, my I can't punt damage. It's just got all my items. I could drop a Mumu for um Caitlyn. It's actually probably better. I get sniper angrily. I should have done that last turn. Like my my Thresh and Elawi will should be good good enough front line. But it's like whatever. What do we think about Arcanist Thresh? 
I think it's fine, you know. Like, because I'm going to be 4 Arcanist, right? Because I'm going to play Syndra. Maybe I don't love the Amumu cell, but I, I don't know. I think it's fine. Like, AP scaling? It's not bad. It's pretty high AP scalings. Champion Conference on Kindred? It's a uh, Champion Delivery. So... Just random champ, unfortunately. I guess we will be four arc then. It's not bad. Yeah, I'm liking the ghostly here, honestly. Nice, it's a great win. I'm actually really strong. Next unit is what? Is what? Next unit is... A Mumu, for, to be honest, and then Syndra over Kindred at seven. We just play a Mumu, Syndra over Kindred. So, do I regret selling the Amumu? A little, but not loads. Here, I went D Claw for Thrash. I have Tear, I can go for Blue Buff or Redemption. It's probably a Blue Buff then. I like Blue Buff. Honestly, I probably just slam it on Kindred right now. Okay, was wondering, since you got Thresh, yeah, I'm just a high roller. <laughs> it's as simple as that, really. Just a high roller. Don't mind me. I just got a Kaiser as well. That can't be bad. I level here. This sells... I mean, I could just... I can just play Double Kindred. I could play Lilia. Yeah, I, mean, I could just play... Like, this, this can't be bad. Just blue buffer. She's going to cast once and do, I don't know, some damage. Just hit set next, no worries. I got you. I got you. Actually, you know what? Like, champ conference, not even, champ delivery, not even bad to play reroll on. Like, you could just get lucky. How much did she do? 677? I'll take it. Can't be that bad, right? Like, I mean, it's, it's decent damage. It's decent damage. Surely you can't be upset. Wait, this guy has not three already. Bro, I feel like every time I play into not, like, they hit, like, so early. It's actually disgusting. I think I'm a Lowy three, maybe, this game. So I'm actually going to buy this. Yeah, I, I don't know what it is, but, like... Like, please don't rotate me into Nah. This guy has Nah 3 already with 50 Gs. It's like, he has Kindred Pair Nah 3. Huh? <laughs> huh? Make it make sense. Please don't rotate me into Nah. Please. 1 and 3. No! And an Orn at 6? What the heck? That's not fair. It's a shame. I feel like streaking into neutrals would have been so big here. It's, it's some rough matchmaking. You would love to dodge this guy until after you, you hit like a Pelios 3. Okay, so this is Syndra. This is a Mumu. This is a, and then this is Ash. Oh my gosh, I trolled. Okay. Syndra on. Okay, I've changed my mind. Ash. Pick up the gold, pick up the gold. What the heck? Syndra, what the? Wait, hold up. Who am I missing? Yes, well. I have an Irelia. What the? That's crazy! <laughs> okay, I need an Aphelios too. Give me Aphelios too, and I'll be a happy guy. Nice. I need to add Yasuo. Yeah. Morning. 
bro. Okay, one over, one over this. Like what? I just hit Syndra randomly. Kind of down for this. Syndra two at seven. Can't be bad. Okay, we just need the Yas, so we're good. Okay, I was complaining about the Nagai high rolling, but now I have Syndra 2. I feel pretty good about my spot. Do I care about Irelia? Like, probably not. I feel like I'm never really playing it. Salvage bin for more Fated Spads later. Combat cost is pretty good in Fated. Huh? Like, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna check. Uh, Explorer, 7 Fated. Augments, combat, cost uh, 3.7. Yeah, that's unbelievable. I mean, something must be out here. Probably this. And I guess this is sold. I kind of want a Morello. Like maybe I'd Morello Syndrome. Brother Syndra. I don't hate it. I feel like she doesn't apply it loads, but like it's still okay. I'm gonna rod her for sure. The thing is, it could just be Nash's plus Archangels and this like Bispus. So close. One unit loss. This two. Kaisa. Uh, people are really strong. Oh, nice. Not be bad. The thing is, like, dropping a Lowry does feel a bit rough here. I can't lie. What if it's this? I don't even hate this. I feel like it's fine. I feel like on printing items is kind of nice, though. It's this and then Yas in. Then how do I get Kindred in? Next level, I guess. I mean, do I even care about Ash 2? To be honest. Like why, why am I playing porcelain here? Or warden, I guess. That's cashed. I don't really care about Ash 2, I think. I'm playing a Lowry for 4 arc. But I play less of a Mumu later for 4 arc. I mean, maybe when I hit Aphelios 3, Thresh 3 will be in a better spot. I like Tear or Bow here. I'm gonna go Bow. I'm gonna build Nash's Syndra here. I mean, this guy is really strong as well. It's kind of rough for me, honestly. Like, maybe I do just build anti-heal, though. Maybe not having anti-heal just means I lose these. It's fine, we'll worry about it later. What if it's just on in next? On in next instead of Ash or Ash or and we keep the Alawi. I think we need Sniper honestly. Just Ash in next and on over Alawi when we're at one two. Yeah, you see that this is like the heal diff. 
Not having heal is really rough into this guy. Not having heal reduction, sorry. Nice, that's a great win. That's actually a really good win. Yeah, I guess I'm rolling zero after this. I'm still pretty far from everything. I don't know if I didn't manage my econ well. Maybe it's because I rolled at six, but I feel pretty poor. He's level 8, 10 gold. So he's kind of just like old in. A little rough. Sindra did ult my Thrash though. I mean Sindra, uh, Cassandra. It's a set diff. Once we have set, we win these. And Aphelios 3, Thresh 3. Okay, I'm down to send it after this. Helios, Thresh, Set, Yasuo, 1. That's like all I care about, right? And Ash, I guess, but like Ash 2, no death. Ash 2, no death. We're gonna have Arcanist Spat without Arcanist in, which is a little rough. Maybe I should have rerolled a Lowry 3 this game. I just kept Kate in. Get in touch with your it's definitely this, and we build tank. I held the greatest blessing. Oop, Fong. Ash, Ash 3. Heliosis. Any more? Big, 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 It's fine, it's fine. We'll hit eventually. Maybe I dug a bit too deep, but oops. Thresh 3 is a big hit, honestly. I need to have Orn right next to Thresh. Oh yeah, I dig I dug way too deep. After I find Thresh 3 there, I don't like I should probably just like see how first round goes. Oh, never mind. I'm just the go of TFT for literally no reason. Not putting tank items on Thresh 3. Well, the thing is, like, one's gonna print one item on him, and then he already has Arc Spat, so then I go, like, Carousel and take one item. So, like, I'd rather just put three full tank items on Orn. And then Orn prints one for Thresh. Like, I could even, like, play like this, but I, I don't particularly want to. Now, I think the value here is more in Orn printing for Thresh. But I need, okay, like I need Orn on same, like the tank side. Alt on, but all. Is it enough? I'm not sure. Nice, that's a huge win. That's a really huge win. Good job, team. Good job, everyone. Okay. Yeah, let me dodge Fortune Cash out one more turn. At least. Okay, this guy just hit Shen 3, so that was a great, great turn to play him. Okay, which side is everyone's damage? Uh, like, pretty much, like, just... I don't think they can melee wrap me. Okay, like, some guy can... One guy can melee wrap me. Uh, I need to have Aphelios and Syndra same side. Like, one guy's melee wrapping me. So, like, let's just do this. And if we're playing against the Kaiser, yeah. I mean, it's a little awkward. It is a little awkward. 
But at least Kaisa's hitting this, which prints for Thrash. Down to print two. Nice Wormogs. Dude, it's this Lissandra. She's actually a problem. And not having set is an absolute problem too. Playing the fortune cash this turn is a bit rough. You look like LeBron James. <laughs> what? <laughs> I've never heard that one before, but you know what? I'll take it. Call me LeBron James. <laughs> That's a good one. I'm actually going to go Crown Guard Thresh over Steadfast Heart. The only thing is, I think if I take Steadfast Heart, I can level here. W stream. <laughs> You look like LeBron James because I'm the GOAT. That's why I got you. 24. Alessandra. Bro. How do I play this? I just drop Ash and play Alessandra here. I didn't even hate it, you know? Dude, I, I feel like not playing Snipe is such, a, such an L. I got you. Yeah, I, I feel like I have to play Sniper here. It's just such a big damage bonus. I need you to print for Thresh before this all. Oh. I mean, still maybe fine. If I hit the Dragon Lord. This is an absolute set diff and it's so upsetting, but... Oh, never mind. It's just goat diff. I'm the goat. I'm the goat. Ash 2, no diff, but we're gonna buy it. It's pad. I'm only into one guy, and this guy is hella strong. But the good news is, I can sack... Sack units into him. Oh no, I can be top guy. I can play against top guy as well. Oh yeah, honestly, I, I probably beat the first place guy. Like high key. Okay, I'm same side. It's a little awkward. I might print for Yas, but I'm pretty sure he's meant to... That is a disaster. I printed for Kindred. Okay. Winnable, winnable, winnable. Oh, huge! That's an unbelievable win. That is an unbelievable win. Good job, team. Good job, team. Okay, we need to get up a level and play less. I mean, I know I sold the list, but like, I'm not getting an upper level if I'm sitting on less. I mean, I can beat this guy now. Like, surely I can beat this guy now. Like, let me play this guy. I think I can beat him. I can beat this guy too, honestly. I just did, so. The only guy I can't beat is the Fortune Cash Out guy, but even that's pretty close. Down to sell Ash Prayer and hold the Alawi. TG, is that a set? Please be a set. Dude, it's so massive. It's actually so massive. It's huge. The set is huge. So fucking huge. What is this little legend and why is it not Mole or Chibi? Uh, Annie picked it because I had redeemed 5k for pick my little legend. And this, this little dude was... This little dude was picked. And honestly... He, he's pulling his weight right now, I'll be honest. This guy's pulling his weight right now. He's doing it. Bro, like having the set pair is big diff. Like huge diff, not even big diff, like massive diff. It's just such a massive difference. I need to stop printing this Kindred items. Like it's absolutely so troll. Top three, can't be unhappy with that. I just, I'm just so dead into this guy, though. <laughs> what am I gonna do? I don't even know. 
like probably thrash has to be here but then like i need some units like tanking the wukong probably has to be this like thrash needs to get altered by this so that Orn can actually print items and thrash is pretty much just like meant to main tank everything while Orn prints it's a disaster we've done it again injured Okay, I'm pretty sure I just can't beat this guy. His fortune cash with an unbelievable board. And Lissandra just counters me so hard. Dude. Wait. Okay, now if I play this guy's ghost somehow and then play main him, we might be fine. I'm 2 HP. I need to play this guy's ghost. I need to play this guy's ghost, and then I need to play him. Which is actually doable, by the way. Play his ghost, then play him. Actually doable. Winnable, winnable, winnable. Okay, and this Kindred needs to stop going near Orn. Please. My Thresh needs items, bro. Like, just go all the way over here. Please stay away from my Thresh. Okay, I, I'm playing him. That means I'm playing the other guy's ghost next, which is a problem. Okay, good. My Thresh got item. I mean, to me, it looks winnable. I have... Oh? Yeah, it's winnable, no? Absolutely. It's, in fact, a great win. The only problem is, I think I play the Fortune Cash guy. 64. I have to take... I have to take something worth 5 gold at least. There's a fated spat. That can't be bad, right? <laughs> Look at this guy. What am I doing? Like, who am I even dropping? Kindred? She's like kind of trolling me. You know, I, I think it's even like a bait to take the fated spat though. Because like... Okay, it's not a bait. I can play this. This doesn't look bad. Like, I, I have to win versus this guy. Like, how? How do I win versus that guy? He looks so Omega Giga strong. Ghost? Okay, I'm Ghost, but is it even winnable? We'll have to see. I'm into Ghost, so it's possible. I need to kill the less. Heal! No! Oh, it's so close. GG everyone, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, remember to like, comment, subscribe. You guys are the goats if you made it this far. Thank you.